One of the uh, very important parts of the climate system, of course, is the ocean circulation, because the ocean transports a great deal of heat around the planet. It transports heat from the warmer equatorial regions up to the cooler polar regions. Uh, and this is done through a grand ocean conveyor, which we call the thermohaline circulation. A very important part of that circulation is the meridional overturning circulation in the Atlantic. What we're talking about here is this grand circulation where heat is transported from the lower latitudes up into the northern North Atlantic. The oceans then lose their heat to the atmosphere, cool, and then those ocean waters drop to greater depths and there's a return flow to lower latitudes. It's very important in this heat transport uh, of regulating the climate. Uh, for example, why is Europe as warm as it is given its latitude? Well, very strongly it's because of this overturning circulation, this heat transport by the ocean poleward. If we were to change that, that can have impacts on climate which are quite widespread, I mean, extending beyond Europe, for example. So we asked the question, could Arctic change influence the nature of that overturning circulation? Potentially so. We know that there was a period back in the late 1960s called the Great Salinity Anomaly, when it looks like we had a shutdown or a partial uh, slowdown of this overturning circulation. In this case, it seems to have been caused by an unusual flux of sea ice out of the Arctic into the North Atlantic putting a freshwater cap on the ocean, and that helped to slow down this circulation. That's one example. But we're also thinking as we go down into the future, what's going to happen is precipitation is going to increase in the Arctic and in high latitudes. That helps to freshen the surface. That's a process which could help slow down that circulation. At the same time, the upper oceans warm, and that does the same sort of thing. Okay? But just what is going to happen? Okay. We don't know. Uh, again, it's one of these wild cards in the system. Uh, how does Arctic change influence the ocean circulation? Well, there's a lot of scientists out there trying to figure this out, but we don't have all the answers yet.